How's it going everyone? In this quick video today, I'm going to be showing you all how to convert your Xbox 360 discs over to ISO files. And all you're going to need for this video today is an Xbox 360 console, a PC, an Xbox 360 game, and a USB drive. And you need to make sure that that USB drive is at least 16 gigabytes and USB 2.0. And jumping right into the tutorial here, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hop on your Xbox 360 and go over to the settings tab. Then go down to system, go to console settings, and then go down to autoplay. And you're going to want to disable autoplay, and then this will prevent the games from just automatically starting, and it'll kind of cause a bit of a hassle when you go to convert these files over to the USB drive. Next, go to storage. And on this page here, you'll notice that you have your few available drives that are just directly connected to the Xbox. And you're now going to want to go ahead and plug in your USB 2.0 USB drive. And after a few seconds, you will see the drive down at the bottom. And it should just be called USB storage device or something like that. And what I would recommend doing just to kind of avoid any errors with like the format or downloading the games to the drive here is going ahead and formatting that. And before you format the drive, make sure you have nothing important on it because formatting does erase the drive. And in order to format the drive, just select the drive and then press Y, go down to format, and then press yes. Now go back to the Xbox home screen. And you can now put your Xbox 360 game into the drive. And for this video today, I'm going to be using Far Cry 3. And now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to highlight the game and then press X to view the game details. Then select install. And make sure you now select the USB storage device. And it's now going to go ahead and install your Xbox 360 game onto the USB flash drive. And this will take like 5 to 10 minutes depending on the size of the disk. And once it's completed downloading to the USB, just press A to continue. And you can now turn off your Xbox 360 and take the USB out. And now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to plug that USB drive in your PC. And once the USB flash drive has mounted on your PC, go ahead and open up the folder and inside of it you'll probably only see a file called name.txt. And this is because hidden items is unchecked. And to see the hidden items, simply go up to the top left of the explorer, go to view, and then go over to the top right and check hidden items. And you should now see a content folder, and inside of that content folder, you should see some files like this. And if you do, you have successfully installed the Xbox 360 game onto the USB flash drive. And we can now go ahead and convert that over to an ISO file. And to do that, I highly recommend a tool called God2ISO, which I will have linked down below. And it is very, very easy to use. So navigate to that link and then scroll down on the page and then just click on download God2ISO and then whatever the latest version is. Then go ahead and save the .rar file to somewhere easy to access. Then open up the location where the .rar downloaded to. And use a tool like 7-zip or WinRAR. And if you don't have either of those, I'll also have those linked down below to extract the .rar file. And you'll be left with a god2iso.exe application here. Just go ahead and double click on that to open it up. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on add. Then locate the USB drive and then the content folder and then just keep clicking through and make sure to click the top folder and you're going to want to click on this file which will be 44 kilobytes and then press open. And then select an output directory. I'm going to save this to my documents and simply press go. And this process here is only going to take about like five minutes or so.
and once the green bar has fully reached the other side of the application, you should now have your ISO file. So go ahead and locate the output directory. For me, that's my documents. And in there, you will see the ISO file. And it should be around like somewhere from like 1 to 20 gigs, depending on your game. And if you'd like, you can go ahead and rename it just so you can keep track of it. And yeah, it's that simple. Just download your game to a USB flash drive and then plug the USB flash drive into your PC. Open up God to ISO and then convert it to an ISO file. And you've got yourself an Xbox 360 game stored locally on your PC. And this ISO file is actually useful for a few things. Say you jailbroke your Xbox 360 and you want to play some of those games without having to put the discs in. Well, you can go ahead and throw these ISO files on your jailbroken console and just run them without the disc. Or say you want to emulate Xbox 360 games on your PC with like Xenia or something like that. You can use these ISO files to play those games. And yeah, I hope you all found this helpful. And as always, if you had any trouble, feel free to leave a comment down below. And all the links will also be available in the description.